What we know now is earlier today, several unmarked vehicles along with Kern County Sheriff's Office patrol vehicles were seen for the majority of the morning outside of the home of Kern County Supervisor for District 2, Zach Scrivener. Eyewitness News reporter Leslie Valle has been working to bring you all the latest details. I'm here in front of Supervisor Zach Scrivener's house in Tehachapi. That's the house that you can see right behind me. Now all that's left is that pickup truck right there. No one else has been seen coming in or out of the house. Now we were told by various neighbors that several Kern County Sheriff's Office patrol vehicles and unmarked vehicles were seen searching his house. We're going to show you video of what eyewitness news saw as we arrived to his neighborhood. This video was taken at 1.30. As you can see, the Kern County Sheriff's Office patrol vehicles exiting his neighborhood. Neighbors we spoke to shortly after this video say law enforcement was here as early as 6 o'clock in the morning. A neighbor who wanted to stay anonymous also told us law enforcement officials were also seen walking out of the home with several boxes. We, of course, reached out to KCSO, who's being very tight-lipped on this situation, telling us, quote, there's nothing there is to discuss, end quote. No arrests, if any, have been announced by the sheriff's office. We also spoke with an official with Scrivener's office. And they told Eyewitness News that the supervisor had not been in the office today, and they were unaware of any sort of incident involving Scrivener. We also reached out to the Kern County District Attorney Cynthia Zimmer's office for information, but we were told, quote, no comment on the issue at this time, end quote. Now, the District Attorney Cynthia Zimmer is the aunt of Zach Scrivener. Now, again, Scrivener was last seen at the Board of Supervisors afternoon meeting on Tuesday. During that meeting, he presented the proclamation on the Crime Victims Week. Scrivener was elected to the Board of Supervisors back in 2010. His district includes Mojave, California City, Rosemond, Warren, and here in Tehachapi. Now we will of course continue to push law enforcement for answers on this developing situation that again we have very little to no information other than what neighbors have told us. For now in Tehachapi, Leslie Valle, Eyewitness News. Hi, I'm Rochelle Murcia with Eyewitness News Bakersfield Now on YouTube. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel where we have tons of great content to choose from. While you're here, go ahead and click on the subscribe button right there. That way you can stay up to date on all the things related within Kern County. Thanks for watching.